Finally tonight, Labor Day is almost here, and so is our Made in America series. You'll remember those commercials. They've been around a long time. But did you know the story behind this classic? You remember the ads and the challenge. Bet you can't eat just one. And we were up for it. With millions getting together this Labor Day weekend, we go right to the chip aisle. I know it well. Hey, David. Chris, how are you? Great to meet you. Good to see you, too. I'll go anywhere where I can get some chips. Frito-Lay, Ruffles, Tostitos, and, of course, Lay's chips. Made with potatoes right here in America. It's the classic, right? Yes. Which is why you call it the classic. That's right. <laughs> an American classic from an American inventor, H.W. Lay. He was a traveling salesman during the Great Depression. 1931, he started peddling chips out of the back of his truck. Seriously? Seriously. And that's how he made a living? It was. Selling potato chips out of this Ford Model A. At the same time, C.E. Doolin had bought the recipe for another American classic, Fritos. And he started making them out of his mother's kitchen. So he's making Fritos. H.W. Lay is making his chips. They're competing against one another, and who knew that they would combine? That's right. That's how Frito-Lay became Frito-Lay. Those two of them joining forces together, 1961. With a little hyphen in the middle. That's right. Workers on the line inspecting the chips, just 10 cents a bag back then. And all these years later, the potatoes still from farmers across America. 120 farms in 25 states. Black Gold Farms in Live Oak, Florida, among them. My great-grandpa started growing potatoes in 1928. And we're, we're potato people. We enjoy potatoes. Those potatoes loaded and trucked two and a half hours north to Perry, Georgia. 1,230 workers waiting to turn them into those famous Lay's chips. 30 plants in the U.S., and it turns out four to five potatoes go into every bag of chips. My husband and I, we play a game in the grocery store. Looking for Lay's chips in your shopping cart. It keeps grocery shopping interesting for us. <laughs> While back at that grocery store. We're going to have to, like, put the camera on hold here. Go out and sample them. Time for the taste test. No one can eat just one, thanks to those farmers and those workers tonight. Made in America! Woo! It is impossible to eat just one. I tried. We celebrate those workers and, of course, the American farmers tonight. And we hope to see you right back here tomorrow. I'm David Muir. Have a good evening. Good night. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.